Hi, Dr. Trachtenberg. How are you doing this morning? I'm good. How are you? I'm doing well. Thank you for joining me. Uh, could you please tell us about this program and what the survey uncovered? Sure, I can. So I've actually teamed up with Parents Magazine as well as Fiverr, Pfizer excuse me, to give you the survey results um, and to really help to educate parents today. Um, what the survey showed, it was really um, assessing the knowledge of new parents and expectant um, parents looking at 11 childhood illnesses and how to prevent them. And really what the survey showed was that um, parents were least knowledgeable about invasive pneumococcal disease. And in fact, 30% uh, said so they never even um, heard of it or they weren't really that knowledgeable about it. Yeah, wow. So how, how does parents' knowledge of invasive pneumonic pneumonical disease compared to the rest of the diseases included within the survey? Sure. Well, invasive pneumococcal disease, or IPD, is just obviously a lot easier to say. Um, it was the yeah. one that parents knew the least about. Um, but it's really important to know about uh, invasive pneumococcal disease because it can have severe complications. Um, invasive pneumococcal disease can cause bacteremia, which is a blood infection, but it can also cause meningitis, which is an infection around the spinal cord um, and the brain, and can be really severe. So it's important yeah. for parents to know about the disease and what they can do to prevent it. Dr. Jen, what is the disease uh, like for children? Are all children at risk? So children are at risk of invasive pneumococcal disease as well as the other childhood infectious disease that are preventable um, by the 14 vaccines for a childhood. But actually children under the age of two are even more susceptible and at higher risk because their immune system um, is still developing. So it's really important for parents to know and to speak to their pediatricians about staying up to date and current with their vaccines according to the CDC uh, recommendations. Where can parents go for more information? For more information, parents can go to babypneumococcalfacts.com to find out more information. Um, they could also go to the CDC website, but also their own pediatrician or healthcare provider also can give them lots of information as well, too. Great. I really appreciate you speaking with me today. Thank you so much for having me.